Hello everyone, today I am going to solve a problem regarding productivity in operations management and this video is prepared for the students of IIMS College MBA weekend. So these are the formulas of productivity, there are three formulas, the first one is partial productivity, the second is total factor productivity and the third one is total productivity and you can see there are different types of partial productivity again like labor productivity, capital productivity and so on uh, and uh, again uh, total productivity has been divided into uh, total productivity um, and multi-factor productivity I think um, uh, five or six problems have already been, already been solved in our uh, last class um, in the real classroom uh, the question is actually um, asked in the board exam of Pokhara University in 2014. Okay, I want to read um, the question first. Uh, Mr. Raju, local auto mechanic, finds that it usually takes him two hours to diagonize and fix a problem. So it takes uh, two hours to diagonize one problem for Mr. Raju. You can see two hours to fix one problem. And uh, what is his daily productivity? working eight hours a day so um, we can directly see uh, his input is going to be eight hours in a day and his output um, i think we have to calculate the output uh, he believes that he can purchase a small computer troubleshooting device which uh, will allow him to find and fix the problem in an incredible or time of one hour so after installing a computer troubleshooting device uh, his uh, time for fixing a problem will reduce from two hours to one hour so uh, actually one hour has been reduced he will however have to spend an extra hour each morning to access the computerized device so he has to uh, spend an extra hour each morning in order to install that device uh, so what will be the impact on his productivity if he purchases the troubleshooting device. I have already uh, prepared the solution for this problem. So um, we have to calculate um, productivity twice here one uh, without troubleshooting device or uh, in a current um, scenario uh, or system, and uh, again we have to calculate uh, the productivity with troubleshooting device so first we have to calculate uh, this part without troubleshooting device we have to identify the input and output first uh, input uh, is going to be eight hours since he he spent eight hours a day per day uh, for uh, solving those problems while produce an output of four problems in a day uh, working eight hour since he can uh, solve one problem in two hour in eight hours he's going to solve four problems so we calculate labor productivity as a as the formula for labor productivity is output divided by labor in input and uh, we can see the output is four problems while the input is eight hours and the productivity has been calculated as 0.5 problems per hour so his productivity currently without using troubleshooting device is 0.5 problems per hour the troubleshooting device his value of input is 8 hours per day uh, there is no change in the value of input as in both cases is going to invest 8 hours in a day so uh, his value of output is something that is going to uh, change you can see uh, dial of output was four problems uh, without troubleshooting device while his value of output has been increased to seven problems and how it is it has been increased is there has been a reduction of one hour per problem it means uh, it takes uh, one hour to solve that particular problem uh, while initially without a troubleshooting device it used to uh, take him two hours it has been reduced to one hour that's why the time it takes to solve one problem is one hour now you can see this part one hour 
and uh, since he has to invest one hour each morning for the installation of um, the machine then the time he can give for solving the problem is uh, seven hours now initially it used to be eight hours while this time it is only seven hours so uh, the balance output has been increased to seven problems so you can see the level productivity level productivity has been increased from 0.5 problems hour, uh, problems per hour to 0.875 problems per hour um, we again we have used the same formula output divided by input and you can see the output is seven problems and the input is eight hours and we have calculated the productivity as 0.875 problems per hour which is the increment of 0.375 problems per hour and unless we um, write the decision we are not going to get the full math your decision should be uh, incompatible with uh, the question given here so what will be the impact on his productivity if he purchase the troubleshooting device so if he purchase the troubleshooting device the current productivity of 0.5 problems per hour will increase to 0.875 problems per hour 